how you guys doing today? Today I'm gonna be reacting to Nine Muses, their new song. It was it was originally called Can't Sleep But Hungry. I guess that's the Korean uh, translated version, which is uh Jong Un An O Gu Panun Um and then it comes out to Sleepless Night, I guess so. That's that's the next translation to it. Um, but besides that, I'm just excited for this. I'm excited to see this. I don't, ugh, I just, I don't know what to expect. But keep, people were saying that the teaser was the intro, and the intro even sounded good. So I'm like, I'm, I'm, I'm going to be happy either way, whichever way the song's gonna turn out. I just don't know how it's gonna turn out. If it's not the intro, I'm, I'm, I'm not, I'm not, I'm like scared because I know it's gonna be so good. I just don't know how good it's gonna be. I'm just ready for it. I'm just ready for it because everyone has new hair. Uh, Sangha, uh, Sangha, it has, um, Freaking blonde hair. Eden has blonde hair uh, also. Freaking, I don't, it just, Sojin has long hair. Like, uh, I don't, what? Who, what, when, where, how, you know, what? Let's just, <clears throat> let's just get into this. <laughs> All right. Oh yeah, and I saw it was like a, like a OCD, like type of concept. I'm just like, uh, I don't know how I feel about that, but it's deep, it's deep, so. Oh girl, you don't have to take, don't do that, don't have to do that. Just take some, mm -mm. Take some, take a lot of uh, vitamins, please, or something. I don't know. Anyways, she looks beautiful. We'll get into this. Oh, oh. Okay, Brave Sound. Hold on, I gotta turn this up. I don't know if y'all be able to hear me, but I gotta turn it up. Oh, girl, you got a present? It's, it's from me. Happy birthday. Merry Christmas. Happy Hanukkah. Oh, that's her singing that part. Yes, Krungi. Yes! Ooh. <gasps> Ooh, so so sassy. Oh, oh. Shirtless guys, hello. Hello, long hair in the back. Ooh. Oh, she said, get off me, bitch. <laughs> yes, Kumjo. Who is that? Oh, that's you and I. They're up. She looks so good with the blonde ombre. Yes. Oh my gosh. My laptop is going to die. Not today. <laughs> Ooh, those shoes are nice. Yes, Sojin. Oh, she's still singing. <laughs> oh, song. Oh my gosh, look at song. Yeah. Oh, she throwing up, but she still looks beautiful. <laughs> Do y'all hear this song though? Ooh. Okay, wait. Okay, there's a story. I should pay attention. <laughs> yes. Okay. What's going on? <gasps> yes. So she has more lines, okay. Gosh, she looks so pretty. Well, who you calling? Who's calling? Okay, Eden. Bitch slay. Ooh. Yes. I love it when she raps fast. Ooh. Yes, so j oh my gosh. That hair. Mm. Amy, I feel like I haven't seen her all video. What the hell? <laughs> she looks pretty though. She always looks so so cute. Okay. Did that happen? Oh, yes! You better pop it, pop it, pop it one more time. Okay, I'm like they're all going through pre presents. Is this? I didn't think it's just like a vis visual. Is there has to be a story to it? Oh, ooh, ooh, give me that. Yes, shirtless guys. Ooh, give me that. Give me that stare, girl. Give me that real stare. Okay, obviously she don't like those shoes. Girl, I said those were cute at the beginning. Wear them. <laughs> and girl, you smudging that makeup on redo. <laughs> See, you look cute. Oh, girl, what's going on? Okay, what's wrong, Amy? What's up? Wait. So wait, does she get that hurt, or is that? Ooh, ooh girl, your cankles though. Mm. Wait, what's going on? I'm so confused. Wait, where did they- No! They weren't all couples. Cause that's like, that's like a couples ring or like a, some type of promise ring. I like that little baby in the back. Oh, maybe I'm right. Maybe, maybe they were connected? So maybe she dated all of them. Those are all of her her exes, and that's why she's like, she's seeing all the gifts, and it's making her emotional.
Yes! Yes! Drop it more time. Oh, do it again, do it again, do it again. <sighs> okay, I, I think I was right. Or at least, you know, uh, Krungi and Mina were exes because they had their promise ring? Oh, okay, oh, good, she did not die. Oh, thank you. <gasps> yes, so they were exes. They were definitely exes. And maybe her and Sojin too. Oh, oh, girl, who's in your bed? Is that Sojin? No. Or is that Mina? Wait, because Sojin has black hair, so. <gasps> oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my, lesbian on lesbian action. Yes! Yes! Snap it up, yes! Okay, okay, Starship. Okay for that, you know, for those references, yes. Or actually, that was like bl blatant, like very, very out there, very out there. So I'm so happy for that, yes. But it was kind of a confusing story, I think, because there was so many flashing scenes. But I kind of pieced it together. It, it seemed like, I guess, she went out with, not Sojin. Oh, uh, she went out, yeah, she went out with Sojin, I guess so. And she went out with uh, Sungya, uh, Sung Ah, my bad. And she went out with also. Hyuna, because Hyuna had that, that perfume, um, and then also Krangi. Maybe she went out with Haimi also. Maybe she went out with everybody. I just didn't see a dress with Haimi, um, and I didn't see Mina like show any dress. Maybe I missed that scene. But maybe, if, if I'm right, let me know in the comments. I'm not sure. I, I'm guessing that's what it was. Maybe I could be wrong. They could all be best friends, like sorority or something like that. I don't know, but from what I saw, it, obviously, it just seems like th those are all her exes. And she, those are all the presents she got from them, or she gave them, or obviously, or like she got for both, for both of them or something like that. And she's feeling guilty because maybe she broke all their hearts. And uh, and yeah, if I, I, I'm thinking that's that's what it is. But yeah, go ahead and tell me your theories in the comments below, and let me know if my theory is right. <laughs> but besides that, they all look freaking beautiful. They all sounded great. I think. I think uh, Krungi had Krung, Krungi Krungi Krungi. I don't <clears throat> never gonna figure out how to say her name, but I believe she um, she had that one ad lib in the pre chorus, the chorus. I don't know, so I just heard her like belting, like oh, something like that. I don't know, but she just sounded amazing and she had that ad lib towards the end. And it seemed like they were giving the the people who don't usually get lines more lines because Mina sung at the beginning, then she sung at the end, but it was like a kind of a lengthy part. And then they gave like Sojin and uh, Songa, uh, Songa um, uh, a lot of lines during the pre-chorus, I believe so. Um, who else? It didn't seem like Kumjo and uh, who else? Kumjo. It didn't seem like Kumjo got any, uh, that much lines. She had like one lengthy part, but that was about it. Uh, but besides that, the, it seems fine. It's just like it's like they're letting everyone else shine. So I I am so down for that, and I'm pretty sure that. Um, they got more lines in the album, obviously. It's for, it's just something that'll, you know, let them shine a little bit more. And I really, 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 really hope that with this comeback, they can somehow get maybe at least just one first place. I know that's stretching it, but, you know, I just, I want them to win something. They have not won first place at all. But they have gotten the words, like, I guess so, um, at other things. But I just want them to at least one one. First, uh, first place at least on one music show. So maybe through Brave, Brave Sound, you know, they can get somewhere. That could be like their next, um, you know, Sweet Tune because you know Sweet Tune used to produce all their music. So maybe Bright Brave Sound can bring something new to the table with Nine Muses and help them get that first place. I really want them to get that. So if you guys like the video, please give it a huge thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe if you haven't subscribed before and leave a comment below telling me your favorite thing about this comeback. Which member has your fa has the favorite haircut for you this um, time around? Because everyone just looks so freaking beautiful. I didn't I forgot to mention Hamey, but I love her bangs. I believe she she's had bangs before, and I believe it was during the uh, ticket era. I believe that was when she had bangs, when she had like short hair and bangs, short hair and bangs and all that. But you know, just tell me who like yours your favorite. Mine is uh, uh, Sunga and um, and Eden. Like the mm, yes, just the blonde short hair is just rocking. They're rocking it so well. Um, yeah, so just let me know what you like. What was your favorite thing about this comeback? And what, did you like the song? Like, what was your favorite thing about the song? And don't forget to follow me on social media like Instagram, Snapchat, or Twitter, which will be in the upper left corner of the video. And it'll also be in the description box below. And I just hope you guys have a great morning, afternoon, or night where you live, and I will talk to you later. See ya!